Ah, cool, cool. So, I'm just gonna fix this light a bit. Oh, that's bright. Okay, cool. So, we're out here. Um, you know, it's about 8 o'clock at night. Finished finish work for today. Um, we're just uh, out here having some fun. Uh, the kids are in bed, so that's good. It's about 8. Uh, eight eight fifteen something like that at the moment. Um, so yeah, we'll just we'll just run through and have a look at what else has arrived for this pocket rocket sidecar. So we've got a nice nice cute little battery here, which, which is good. Um, this is pretty much going to be just running the starter motor um, and maybe some LED light strips. We'll see we'll see what happens with that. Um, we've got like a little starter relay, um, which 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 has arrived for that one. We've got fuel filters, got a bag of them. I'm not too sure how they're going to go, haven't used these ones before, but that's fine. We've got the headstock bearings, which has arrived in a pack of, uh, one of these, in, in a pack of 10, something like that. So these are, um, 30 mil outside and then 10 mil inside, which, which will be good, which will suit what we need for, for our one. So nice little pack there. Um, what else is rocked up? Do, 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 do. Um, so we've also got the um, additional chain. Ah, cool, cool. So what else have we got? So we've got um, also rear axle that's rocked up. So that's a uh, 220. That's an, a, a, a 10 mil axle with a 8.8 .8, um, high tensile grading. Um, it's 220 long. Um, and then we've also got the sidecar axles. Cool. So we've also got the uh, sidecar axles. So these are actually a 10.9, I'm pretty sure. High tensile, 12 mil, 140 40 mil um, bolt. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to cut the ends off these ones and then weld it on a plate and then it'll come out to the sidecar wheel there. Um, provided it fits, which we'll test right now. Oh no, it doesn't fit. No. No, look at that. Perfect. Um, yeah, we guessed about 140 mil. Um, so I'll uh, chuck the camera down here. So yeah, that comes out either side. Um, so we'll do up some spaces um, on either side to, to fit that one and should be angled over with that end cut off. So it's a nice high tensile rating. Um, which is excellent, uh, that worked out really nice. Um, cool. Uh, what else have we got, Rock Up? Um, do, 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 do. Yeah, just talking about the chain. So we've got, um, so this is actually 160 link, where the other one that, we, that come with the bike is 135. Um, that's why we're probably running a little bit short, but that, that's all right. Um, we've got that now, so that's cool. Um, I don't think I think that's about everything that's rocked up um, so far. We're still waiting on a couple of things. Um, we're still waiting on. Um, that's a very good question. We're still waiting on the starter motor. We're still waiting on um, uh, starter push button. Um, that hasn't rocked up yet. Um, that's fine. Uh, we're still waiting on. Um, can't think what else to be honest. I don't think we're waiting on too much to be honest. So yeah, no, it'll be it'll be good. So it's all coming together. Uh, yeah, I'll just go over and show the bike at the moment. Um, hasn't done too much since we last sort of looked at it, or the end of last video. We uh, haven't really had too much time, but um, yeah. So we've got sort of the um, lower foot plate coming around this one and then we're going to weigh it well to like a half inch sort of like a um, heel stopper on top of there and then it'll come around there which will be good then we're going to do um, one continuous loop 180 degrees um, all the way around the front of this engine um, all, all the way sorry out to the side so probably 90 degrees and then um, over on the other side um, some straight some straight straight bars um, so that'll be good That'll pretty much be almost the whole frame. A um, little bit of, little bit of tidying up here, here and there. Then it'll be coming off the jig, uh, and then putting the headstock in, making up the front end. Front end's pretty much ah, oh, sorry, that triple clamps. Uh, that's another thing we're waiting on. 
um, triple clamps to come, so they're going to be pretty trick. I've ordered red ones, um, so it's going to be pretty mad straight off the bat. Um, so it'll match the, the engine on, on that. Um, what else? Do, 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 do. Um, I talked about last time about the plate that I'm going to do up, which I've got the steel here for. Um, and then that'll support the bottom of the engine, so that'll be all made up nice and trick. Um, I think that's about it. I think that's about it. We've had a few things rock up during the week, which is good. Uh, and then, yeah, we'll be able to just slowly put it together. We'll have pretty much everything here by the time the frame's finished. Then it's just a matter of smashing it all together. Um, which will be good. Um, probably make up a little battery box to support this as well. Like so to give you an idea, so that's a 140mm bolt. Um, and that's that's pretty much it. <laughs> that's it. So, you know, it's it's nothing nothing in nothing in um, sizing. It's only it's only real baby batteries. So um, that's it's only gonna need a baby battery to start over the, the starter motor and run the LEDs. So yeah, it's gonna need nothing. It's not even a, a fuel pump, um, it's all gravity fed, so um, yeah, be there'll be absolutely barely anything on, on this one. Um so yeah, so that's the old axle that we had in there. So that was about a 200 or a 190, I think it is. Um, and that's how they compare with the new one. So it's just going to allow that bit more room. Um, making up spaces for it's nothing. We do all 6160. Um, sorry, 6061 uh, aluminium um, spacing for it. That'll be all all made up and all, all to suit the, the rear axle plates over there. So cool, cool. I'm um, going to get into it uh, be able to... To go from there. Till next time.